Hello everyone, welcome to Red Snapper. My name's MJ and we have been playing Wiccan and oh God, I am conflicted. I was honestly like deciding between two different thumbnails. I didn't know whether to go the nuclear one, which I think is probably the one that I've uploaded and that you clicked on. But honestly, I, I could have done one that was like a, a shit emoji as well, because this guy is going to be a tough nut to crack. As we sort of suspected might be the case when we did our snap our pass, snap our, snap our pass, snap or pass video, we suggested that the deck building challenges was going to be the toughest thing to crack with Wiccan, and that definitely seems like it's the case. As you can see on screen, we've played two different decks this evening. One of them was like a shield style deck, which leaned into the card generation and also had Iron Man. We had Gwenpool in both decks, actually. Uh, so the other deck was like a Quicksilver deck. That was Quicksilver being our only one cost card. And then relied on like the Zabu and the Psylocke, which, well, we actually had Zabu and Psylocke in both decks. Because you want to get Wiccan out on turn three. That's definitely when he seemed to make the most, most sense. We had magic out at one point as well and extending the game probably made sense. We had a big problem with locations getting clogged, both from the generated cards, like we had Savage Land bloody come up, two Raptors, certainly not, not what you want to see when, you're, when you've got so much energy that you need to play out all of your cards. But another problem is like we saw some Cassandra Novas and because we had low power cards like Psylocke and Zabu, they were getting hit. So it was tough to even play out cards. And everything was just a little bit awkward and a little bit tough with Wiccan. Now, like I say, I think I probably uploaded the nuclear thumbnail because when he pops off, he pops off. The first game we had with him... It was absolutely explosive and incredible. And do you know what? It wasn't even hard to double trigger this guy. This guy with Odin is like certainly the thing that makes the most sense so far. That was fantastic and we pulled it off a couple of times. The problem was that following the Odin, we just didn't have enough to do. Because with these decks, you need the curve, you need to like map out the curve be that Quicksilver into Zabu, into Psylocke or whatever. Uh, but you need that consistency. So you need quite a lot of cheap cards in your deck in order to be able to do that. So you need that. But then you need enough expensive cards in your deck in order to benefit from the extra energy. This was the exact problem that we thought might happen. Uh, and the problem is, once you've got the consistency of the lower cost curve, it barely leaves enough energy left over or, or card slots left over to have those high power cards so that was what felt really difficult we tried nick fury didn't quite work out the gwenpool did feel nice because you're buffing your lower lower powered cards so that felt good um but yeah in general very difficult i think the decks that i'm playing here are definitely not the way to go uh, there's definitely some good things like the Odin, I think makes sense. Zabu and Psylocke certainly make sense. Weirdly, I think Quicksilver might feel better than the other one costs. I'm not sure it's a hard one, guys. You you watch the, watch the games that we captured and see what you think. I'm completely still up in the air. I don't 100% know what to think, but I hope you enjoy these first gameplay highlights that we got with Wiccan, and I'm really eager to hear what you think in the comments below so thanks good enjoy <laughs> cheers okay right we've got the curve we've got the curve so far so that's good sasquatch wow that's actually a really good card <gasps> oh my god oh my god it's happening oh my god do you see he's fizzing he must fizz when you when you oh my god look at him fizzing in the hand his effects are freaking sick, are you kidding me? Okay, this is okay, this is feeling cracked now. And I'm going straight into the Odin. Oh, this is getting filthy, guys. <gasps> guys. Oh my god, I'm feeling sick. This is incredible. Oh, look at that effect. All the lightning and stuff, that's so cool. Right, I am actually gonna go Odin. <gasps> yeah, just Odin. So I need to get, actually, I mean, arguably, Odin might not have been the play, but we do have this zero cost card. Oh my god. 
Heimdall. It's, Are it's you interesting. Worthy? Could actually Heimdall now? Because it free they think they're gonna win mid. Oh they hang on, how do they actually win mid there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight with their surfer, they get plus eight, which is sixteen. They can double trigger it. Uh I'm on nine energy. <laughs> oh we got power region plays, man like Sherbert. Um guys. We are absolutely crackalating here. I think I do actually do Heimdall. So I'm going to Heimdall first. Then Quinners. Then Gwenpool. I'm actually, I've run out of space. I actually have more, I actually have more cards than I can. I don't think I can, I don't think I can afford to play Quinjet. Let's do this, this. I'm pretty sure this is the play. Let's, let's send it. I'm pretty sure that's the play. I see the play. So we're going boom. We go Colts. Ooh. Well, that Death Strike is quite tempting, actually. Ooh, Wongers. Okay, so it's gonna. Death Strike's not gonna have to be right, I think. Six, three, four, five. Okay, and we can get Ms. Marvel as well. So I think we do that. We have to Ms. Marvel, and it's just that. It's just that. Get rid of that bloody one. It's sure, and it's just surfer. Wow! Look how devastating the the lady death strike was. The lady death strike was devastating for them, mate. That is so sick. I'm oh, made up with that. Mission accomplished. Um. Oh my god, guys, we haven't got it. We haven't got it. We're about to see what it feels like when you dud Wiccan. Could could just retreat, but I mean we've got plenty. We've still got we've still got Oh There's there's Arbor. I mean that Tell me they're not also running Wiccan, right? Uh, oh So I'm gonna snap, but I'm not gonna snap just yet. Because they'll surely know. They will surely know. That I've got Acid Arrow. 100%. So let's go... I think... I think I do... I think I just do that. But now we snap. Let's see if they... They're, they're a fool to stay in here because of Bar Sinister. Unless they block Bar Sinister themselves. You only snap when it's a win. Love that Hawkeye font. Mate. Wow, that is an early crossbones. I don't have Shang-Chi either, so there's nothing I can do about that. I pretty much have to hope that Quinjet right into Coulson is like going to be enough to secure me another location. I mean, we might be all right. Let's let's have a look. Or I could do the Wiccan now just for the seven power. That's fine. Oh, now this could get weird. No, I think I have to do that on... Let's do that there. No, I have to play Quinjet now. I can Absorbing Man next turn. Do I want the... Fo no, I think I do that. I think I do that. And probably Absorbing Man. You only snap when you're win. <laughs> you only snap when you're winning. <laughs> snap, for Pete's sake. Pete's sake. Ooh. Not the best card, but not the worst. Oh. Okay, so yeah, the final turn's going to be a shocker for them. I think we do that and that. <sighs> How much energy do I actually have to pull in, though? Do I do Absorbing Man? I need the energy. Do they... Oh, sh oh, oh, crikey. Maybe it's just this. The Miz And then it's Ms. Marvel and... Yeah, I think it maybe it's that. Oh, we've got ligature marks. Jubilee is coming down for the... Echo. 
Oh my god, that's killed our Ms. Marvel play. Oh my god, it's goated our Red Skull play though. 2-2, two, two, so we can't do... Right, okay, right, hang on. I mean, that is that is the way to go, but hear me out. We can also do this. This is adding 4 and minusing 1. So it's 11, 22. That never wins. It has to be that, but how, how else do we win? What is the other way we win? It's just that. Right, what do, oh my god, we ha I did not realise that we had priority, to be honest. I hope that's not Shang-Chi there. <laughs> Only Scar, thankfully. So, you can get through a game without, without triggering Wiccan. It, you can do it. You can do it. Okay, here we go, come on. Let's get a proper curve going here. We've got two turns to draw a good curve. Okay, fine. Oh, I probably should have done Agent 13 there. Wow, avoided the double echo. That's funny. I should have done Agent 13 there. Oh, thankfully. Thankfully, wankfully. The problem is, I mean, I hope that we get Acid Arrow because we really need the space. And I, need to, I probably need to play all three cards here unless I pull a Zabu or something. Oh, there we go. That'll do. Oh, my God, that's... Oh, that's really good. Okay, um, so we want... Yeah, probably Agent 13, I think. We have to do this. Oh, wow, that's good. The The fact that the, in, in this clog, two clog locations, and they get Green Goblin from Camp Lee, that is absolutely insane. My, my Venom had better go right here. That is absolutely in freaking sane. Oh, midders. That is shocking. Well, pretty much have to do that, I think. They've snapped. I mean, yeah, I think they're going to destroy us, to be fair. But we can do some fun Gwenpool stuff. We can definitely do some fun Gwenpool stuff. They've gone Cassandra Nova with the 7 and the 13. If this goes right... <laughs> God, this feels bloody unfortunate, doesn't it? Um, yeah, I think I just have to do that. Let's just see what happens. I mean, we don't win this. I have to say, I think they did get sort of insanely lucky. Okay, didn't go. We need... Mm, yeah. Awful. That is... That is extraordinary. And we'd like... Not like... Iron Man would have been a good top deck. That's crazy. That is crazy. I, we're going to have to obviously, obviously retreat. But... Um, I mean, it would be that. But it's just nowhere near enough. Oh, that is cringe. Right. Come on, Wiccan. And they've just nicked our Iron Man. Decent. Which they'll happily, happily play, I should think. Although we've got Mockingbird. Uh, we can actually play Quinjet. I'm going to play Quinjet right to avoid their Echo. Oh, we've got Priority anyway, fine. Because we're going to always Psylocke here. Cost... Hang on. Right, I can certainly snap here. Um... Costs one less for each card that didn't... St oh, so because this is my opponent's, this is getting discounted by my own cards. That's bloody funny. Right, the Mysterio's coming down here for the Sasquatch. You'd have to assume, once again. Right. Let's freaking go. Wow. Remarkable. Um, I'm just going to go Iron Man this turn, I think. Oh, wrong order, wrong order, wrong order, wrong order, wrong order. Just in case we pull um, Absorbing Man. We'll go for this order. Definitely going to probably want to get Agent 13 out. Man. They've gone Iron Man Iron mid. Man. Which, 
presumably they've got mate, mate, they're Cassandra names. St starting to piss me off. Um, I think we just got to dump this mid, pretty much. So this is the slight issue with Wiccan in that. This this leech isn't too bad here. Oh, annoyingly got Scar out there. I was hoping to target. If their Sasquatch comes out, it's going to be bloody annoying. Uh, what did we just play? Get the arrows out. Why? Hang on. What is going on? Why is this Mockingbird not getting discounted? Is... Is... is, is Hang on, am I? I might be messing up here. Is this just strictly better? Nah. Let's just see. I don't know. They've gone blink right. We Pull out are the future. Wow, that is filthy. It's good that it's given us more room right though. And we got Pym Arrow, which is probably what I wanted to see. Okay, and that hopefully has just nuked their Sasquatch. This is probably winnable. We've got eight. Oof. That is a shit top deck. I think we have to go the ten right. The biggest thing we have is, is four, which is obviously eight. So it's 26. They can do that so easily. They can win that so easily. I just have to hope that it scares that they're scared off. Like, wow, feels like we, yeah. Oh, unreal. That is unreal. Oh, that makes me feel sick. Wait, hang on. Oh my god, I can't believe we still won. Oh, we got Rumdumptious! How are you feeling, Rumdumptious? You are very handsome. Well, okay, this is looking better. We just need one of our two drops. We've got a lot of two drops in our... There we go. There we go. We, we've got a gap on three, though. We ideally want a top deck Psylocke or... Ooh. Let's do this. They can get... We need to be conscious that they can get in there with... Um, Captain Marvel. Oh, they're playing Wiccan. They're playing Wiccan themselves. And we've missed the curve, guys. We have missed the curve. Oh, very rough. That feels really, really rough. Wiccan is starting to feel fucking awkward, to be honest. What made the pig 10? Uh, that was Elias power. Marvel boy. Okay. So, we're going to go Wiccan here. Just because we've got nothing. Next turn we can do Gwenpool. I could actually have Gwenpool that turn, but it's just a bloody stupid thing to do. And we can probably quite easily win left on the final turn. Especially if we Gwenpool. There's Captain Marvel. So that's how they win mid. Oof, this is so rough. Elias left might win it for us, so I think we just have to do. This is pulling Odin, maybe. Oh, it's actually... Yeah, it is actually guaranteed pulling Odin. It's not the worst. I mean, it's actually less power, but... Let's see what happens. Are you Odin, worthy? It doesn't re... Yeah. They've got Cassandra mid. That's quite unusual. Oh, so now they can win mid with... That is seriously 10. Oh my god. We can't actually win. We literally can't win. Oof. It is, do you know what? It's a shame that our best game with Wicked was like easily our first game. 
I was like, oh my god, he's going to be amazing. Okay, come on. We just need one of our two-cost cards. And ideally, look at this. Look at these draws. These draws are so bad. Come on, give me a two-cost. Like, I just want to trigger this damn guy. Oh, thankfully. And as long as this isn't a ridiculous cost from our opponent. Okay, we've done it. We've done it. Oh my god. Wait, they... Wow. Interesting. Um... Ooh. Magic is good. I think I have to snap here. Hang on, hang on. The raft is bait. Raft is bait. Right. Wiccan. They can't fill left. Oh my god, they filled left this time. So they foregoed the Wiccan. They for forewent Wiccan. This is cool. Oh, annoying. That, are they playing the same deck as our last uh, player? As our last uh, person? Right, we're going to Odin. And we can also... Yeah, this is this is sick. We're Odining like mad. Oh, shit, hang on. No, 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 no. Fuck. I needed to turn seven. And I've literally got nothing I can do on the final turn. Apart from just play all of these cards. There's Claw. I mean, they can Shang-Chi, right? We've got ten energy. Wow, look at this. So bad. Um, we, we can at least do that. So it's, this is probably, what What are we pulling out of our deck? Eliath, uh, Lad, if they Shang-Chi right, they're on 14, so I think we have to play Gwenpool there, I think it's that, it's that but I'm not happy about it. Okay, so there's, I'm glad we hard stacked right. Oh, no strings on me. What on earth is that? Okay. We c we can win. Let's go. Cassandra Nova is causing me bloody issues today though, guys. I'll tell you that much. She is causing bloody problems. Victory. This wench. Again, we need these two two drops. The Zabu. That is not what we want. That is not what we want to be top decking. Come on, please. Give us. Oh my god, there it is. We're snapping. They must know what's up. They've snapped back. They know what's up. So they must surely be Zabu. But we win left because they haven't played Quicksilver left. Like, they can have the exact same curve, curve as us, Zabu into Wiccan. But they haven't played left, so... They've gone Jeff, man like Jeff. I'm not seeing it, guys. Don't see how they do this. Oh, my God. With, with that, honestly. They've gone... Oh, my God, I thought that was going to be a liar then. I was going to seize. Right, so, we're on... We're on six. Hang on. Do I want to do that? Or do I want to do this? And then Odin next turn. The problem is they're going to win. They're going to win here. I'm going to I'm going to double. Double stack. Are ye worthy? Because I don't. Oh my god. We can actually play Fury and Gwenpool. That feels really good. They have Wiccaned. They can probably win left with Captain Marvel. Well, no, they can only draw, actually. Depends what they do. Um, are you thinking... Right, we're on eight. I think... I'm not sure. I think it has to be this order here. I think it has to be that, and we don't even play these. Although I've got three. Hmm... How much energy are we actually going to be on? We need to do some maths. 9, 10, 11. 
We'd be on 11 if I played Psylocke. So I wouldn't be able to play two of the six costs anyway. We're only ever playing one six cost, basically. So the order might actually be that. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, the order might actually be that. Oh my god, I forgot that was bloody uh, Nebula. Uh, still oh my god, if they've got... Heroes. Oh, they can win left. Oh my god, and they've got Red Hulk. That is fucked. Is Blob good here? Ooh. Elioth left. Oh, how does this lose? How does this lose? They play Claw mid. This doesn't ever lose. See you later, Claw. They gave the fist bump because they thought they'd won, I reckon. But see you later, Claw. Bye, Claw. Ah. Zabu. Yeah, not even the Captain Marvel can move. Bitch. Get out of here, bitch. Yeah, that was filth. Elioth on uh, Washington, D.C. Not what you want to see, to be honest, guys. But I take that. Wiccan is interesting. I think I might have to stick with the nuclear thumbnail. I think I might have to stick with the nuclear thumbnail.